Man cannot change or escape his time. The eye sees the present and the future. This famous quote was said by famous surrealist painter Salvador Dali, a Spanish painter known for his unusual and eccentric paintings. He was most well known for his painting The Persistence of Memory. He is most famous for his contribution to the world of art. He is among the most versatile and prolific artists of the 20th century and the most famous surrealist, though chiefly remembered for his painterly output. In the course of his long career, he successfully turned to sculpture, printmaking, fashion, advertising, writing, and perhaps most famously, filmmaking. Hi, welcome to my channel, and we're going to take a look at some fascinating facts about Salvador Dali in this video. Number 1. Salvador Dali believed he was the reincarnation of his dead older brother. Dali's older brother was born almost 3 years before him and was also named Salvador Dali. Just nine months before Dali was born, on August 1, 1903, Dali's older brother died of a stomach problem. Dali's parents took his birth so soon after the death of their first child to be a sign and believed that Dali was his reincarnation. When Dali was five, they took him to his older brother's grave and shared their belief in reincarnation with him, something that he too came to believe. Number 2. Salvador Dali was expelled from the same art school not once, but twice, during Dali's time at the Real Academia de Bellas Artes de San Fernando, he was a well-known troublemaker. In 1923 he was accused of leading a student protest and was consequently expelled. He was allowed to return to the school and repeat an academic year, yet he ended up being expelled again in 1926 just before his final examination. This time it was permanent though, as he declared to his examiners that he was more intelligent than them, thus they could not possibly examine him. Number 3. To avoid paying restaurant bills, Dali would draw on the backs of checks. Thrifty and clever, Dali found an innovative way get out of paying for a meal. It is said that when he dined with a large group of friends, he would offer to pay the bill. He then pay with a check, but, included doodle on the back knowing that the check would never get cashed seeing as the doodle he'd left was infinitely more valuable. Number 4. Salvador Dali worked with Alfred Hitchcock and Walt Disney. Famed director Alfred Hitchcock asked Dali to help create paintings for the dream sequences in his 1945 film, Spellbound. Dali also worked with John Hench, a Disney designer in 1946 on an animated movie called Destino. For the film, Dali completed 22 oil paintings and drawings, which became storyboards. Number 5. Salvador Dali was absolutely obsessed with money. Salvador Dali would go to almost any extent to acquire money, to the point that his colleagues would refer to him as Abita Dollars. This is an anagram of his name which translates into eager for dollars. He would take almost any job, among them was designing the logo of the popular lollipop company Chupa Chups. Number 6. He had a pet ocelot named Babu. He adopted Babu in the 1960s, and brought him everywhere with him including restaurants. He is also remembered for his pet anteater which he took on walks through the streets of Paris and even brought him on an appearance of the Dick Cavett show. Number 7. He designed a jeweled ruby heart that actually beats. Dali collaborated on a line of jewels called Dali Joie with the American millionaire Cummins Catherwood, combining Dali's designs with jewels provided by Catherwood. The collection's piece de resistance is the royal heart, a ruby, diamond and emerald encrusted corazon, which, somewhat disconcertingly beats. This piece is now in Museum of Salvador Dali Foundation. Number 8. His iconic mustache had a literary inspiration. Dali's upturned mustache may be the most famed facial hair of art history. A cultural emblem in its own right. The look has inspired quite a bit of speculation with some suggesting it is a tribute to Spanish Golden Age painter Diego Velázquez. However in a television appearance, Dali stated plainly, it's the most serious part of my personality. It's a very simple Hungarian mustache. Number 9. He developed a new style called nuclear mysticism. After the war, Dali developed a new style for his works that sought to represent science and Catholic imagery. This new style was born out of Dali's hope that new scientific discoveries would unlock the unknown surrounding religion. The pieces he created during this time, while still being otherworldly and surreal, focus less on personal subjects and more on universal, scientific themes. Number 10. Salvador Dali built a museum for himself and then died in it. 
The mayor of Dali's hometown asked him to donate a piece of his art to the town's museum but ended up with much more than he asked for. Dali ended up rebuilding the municipal theater where he held his first exhibition into a museum dedicated to himself and his works. Dali lived in the museum in the last few years of his life and died there in 1989. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button or subscribe to my channel.